what you'll need to do is obtain your spare battery. Grab your AED and turn it over. And on the reverse side, you'll notice two lugs. These can be unscrewed off the back of your defibrillator. Then you pull back on the plastic backing and that exposes the battery that's inside your AED. At this stage we can lift that out and pull that away from the back of the defibrillator. With your new AED battery you'll notice that there's three holes and these need to be put into uh, the lugs that are inside the defibrillator. Push those on like so, making sure that you line it up correctly and push it down. Slide your new battery in the back of the defibrillator, replace the cover and then put the lugs back on. Make sure when we tighten them back up they're only tight and finger tight. At this stage you'll also notice that there will be no lights showing on your AED. If you give it around about 30 seconds to 40 seconds your AED will start to perform a battery insertion test as it's now received a new battery. So at the moment the unit's starting a self test so you'll see a light's illuminated, the battery indicators come good and at that stage your AED is now rescue ready. You have two dark indicators showing and an OK symbol which means your AED is now rescue ready.